inevitable. Perfect for the beautiful game. Temperatures are kind as well. No doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level of anticipation here. Surely this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods. It surely must be. It is a venue, this, which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. Has a pop! Forward it goes. Brings it forward. Tries to dink it in. Now hits one! I can't speak highly enough of the keeper after that save. Can't stop thinking about it. And the weighted pass. Rudiger drives it forward. And it's Benzema. And here's Azar. Azar just brushed off the ball there. Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team, really, your striker should be the first line of that defence, and, and he's delivering. Goes to finish! Goal! Real Madrid! And Real Madrid are ahead! Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Real Madrid, draw first blood here. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. Benzema, out to the right. Plays it long. Gets up to head it! Oh, he's managed to get it all wrong. It was such a clever idea to lift it into his path. Partey. Gabriel Jesus. Well, that's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Tony Kroos. Hardly anything between the sides, and the score is 1-0. Turns and goes back. Now it's Az... It's Azar! Oh, denied brilliantly! Hazard really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. Looks to dink one in. Saka. He's gone for it! Oh, that's neat. Deflected behind for a corner kick. <laughs> Granit Xhaka plays it in. challenge but fair enough Casemiro and the referee brings the first half to a close so there you have it a close sport half of football but one that still had its moments but ultimately produced just one goal a more than decent game up to now well that certainly pleased the fans and the players are definitely happy with that scoreline the question is now can they protect it Real Madrid come in, having established that lead. A game where the narrative is, at least in terms of the scoreline, so far so good. And we are already promptly back on the way. A solitary goal. That has been the crucial difference. Modric, Benzema, real chance! Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish.
Oh, it was such a clever pass that plummets the defence, and it could well be revisited, this. Tries to get it forward quickly. He's found his man, and the flag has stayed down. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Hoists it forward. It's a great gallop down the right-hand side. Gets the better of his man. Whipped in. Your impression so far... Going for goal! It's broken loose. Real Madrid have it back and they can go again. Well, there's no sign here of forwards working back. They are staying upfield. They are, Peter, and it gives them a chance to, to break, but it's also causing a, an extra defensive presence to, to prevent that. And it's Shaka. Gabriel has a hit! Really well taken goal. Oh, high quality goal. Lovely first touch, sumptuous second. Arsenal grab the equaliser and we're all square. Yeah, for me, both sides are strong and well matched, and I think you need to be a good player to be out there right now. Saka tried to play it through. Yeah, the idea was right. The delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. Let down by a lack of accuracy. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Courtois can pick that up. I think that's offside. Yes, it is. Arsenal are making a change now. Granite Xhaka. Gabriel Jesus. Gabriel Jesus not easily shrugged off the ball. Modric. Decent progress down the left. So nothing between them in 90 minutes, and we are in for extra time. Well, I don't think either manager can have any complaints, really, because nobody quite pushed for the winning goal, and it always lacked that spark. So a brief breather, and then extra time. Stern test this for the endurance, for the character of the players as we head into extra time. That intervention was very necessary. Well, I'm not quite sure he needed to hold up play quite as much as he did then. A couple of his teammates were very annoyed. Goes for it! Oh, should have put that away. Well, maybe the tension around this game played a part in that because he should have put them ahead then. And it's Azar. Saka, Granit Xhaka, out to the left it goes.
Benzema. And the assistant referee has his flag raised for offside. So, time for changes on both sides, actually. We've reached the midway point in extra time. Well, it may well be a case of who's got most to give now. Fitness levels look good, and it's not any less competitive. And we're off for the final time. This has been enthralling. So, what do the last 15 minutes have left? Lacazette. Keeper's got good distance on that. And it's Azar. And it's played forward. Out for a throw. Time for a change in personnel. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but he couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Back into the middle. Hazard. Real Madrid don't have many options, and time is running out. And here's Benzema. Oh, he's caught him in or out. Uh, the referees decided that he was fouled outside the box, and it is just a free kick. And this is the big, big chance. Well, if he truly fancies his chances from here, he's going to need the best of the best. He's tried one! Could fall kindly! The whistle has gone, and it is all over. Well, no winner here, but an intriguing game. The result, probably a fair reflection. It has finished all square. Your reflections then, Jim. Well, a decent draw, Peter. With... There's the whistle, and here we go. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Yeah, Gabriel Jesus. He's always going to be a massive threat, Peter. And that's primarily because his movement off the ball is so effective. Even if he doesn't end up touching the ball, he usually plays a part in his team's attacking plays. Yeah, he's fouled him there. Good take, and he's had a look. And it's played forward, played back in. Yeah, it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Partey gets it back. Tries to get it forward quickly. No, that's not the ball he wanted. Tony Kroos. Oh, good interception. There really wasn't very much in that. Not far away from being a telling final ball. Uh, that was just poor decision-making and a weak execution. Oh, well played, he saw that coming. Benzema has a pop! It's off target and by quite a way. All he'll be thinking is, please, ground, swallow me up. He's left his man. Oh, real danger here. Going for goal! Oh, that is rather wayward. 
Do I really need to tell you, Peter, that he has to do better, especially from there? So a third of the match, or thereabouts, gone, and we still await the first goal. Forward it goes. Gabriel Jesus is flagged offside. Just brushed off the ball there. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Oh, that's nice. Pings it in. Gross goes looking. Modric. Good running with the ball. Can they build on it? And it's Azar. It's a good foot in there. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Well, if he's serious about trying from this range, I think he, he must feel he can generate the power. Big ask. Defence can get it clear. Good effort, and it is right on half time. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. How's the first half compared with your expectation? Unspectacular, but solid, and that solidity could yet be the foundation for them to, to go on and win. An intriguing half, lacking only in goals. The score, nil-nil. And we are already promptly back on the way. Real Madrid clearly have been... And the shot! And oh! Kroos. Kroos goes up and up. And the finish! Marvellous goal! Oh, the skipper has made such an important difference to put them in the lead again, but they can't afford to retreat and defend for the rest of this second half. To do that would invite trouble. Real Madrid are really pouncing on any stray passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Real Madrid get themselves into the lead. He's just gone and reminded us yet again of what a threat he carries. Gabriel Jesus. Gabriel Jesus unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Hoists it forward. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Nicely controlled. Trills one in. Oh, that is Ask has a pop! Goal! Arsenal are level. That was a given, it always was. Yeah, and I think we may have had too many defenders ball-watching then because they just lost sight of the real danger. Arsenal grabbed the equaliser and we're all square. Oh, look, Peter, I was on the fence before a ball was kicked and... Uh... Has a shot! Great run this, he's covered quite a distance. Well, I don't think it was the wisest option, Peter, once he got into that position. It's not as if he didn't have people nearby.
Well, there's no sign here of forwards working back. They are staying upfield. They are, Peter, and it gives them a chance to, to break, but it's also causing a, an extra defensive presence to, to prevent that. If we're going to get a winner, it's got to come now. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Tony Kroos. And here's Benzema. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. And here's Benzema. That's a brilliant interception. It is going to need 30 more minutes. No winner after 90. Yeah, no daylight between these two sides, but I have to say, neither side really did enough to find a winner. They just cancelled each other out. So all square. We need a winner, and we will be back for extra time. And the action has already reached a chance! Oh, that's incredible! Late in the day, this could well be it! Just so calm under pressure. Well, I think that defence there thought they were in good position, and they had him where they wanted, yet somehow he's worked a scoring position when it didn't see him on. Real chance! Arsenal have a free kick. Yeah, and it's a good opportunity to level it, and they have several in this team who can who can take this. This certainly looks appetising, well within shooting range. Going for goal! Decent hit from there. Cuts it out. Oh, he's not going to get that. <laughs> Has gone out. Arsenal can make their change now with uh, a break in play. Goes for a sweeping cross. Good challenge, he just stood firm. And it's played forward. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Ah, uh, was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. Time, extra time. Well, there's plenty of potential for a final twist in this tale. I think there's bound to be some late drama in the final 15 minutes of this epic. And we're off for the final time. They have given it everything. The referee's awarded a free kick. Checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. Benzema, Hazard. Hits one! And that would have won it. Oh, and a real chance to pile on the pressure, and he'll be desperate to get another. Gabriel Schissel tries a shot! And yes, it's there! What remarkable powers of recovery!
Well, I think there's a few trying to claim offside, but he looks to have been on. Yeah, he was on. His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat-trick. This is quite a battle. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. Shoots! And they've been caught out here. And there goes the final whistle. A game chock full of moments and talking points. It could have gone either way, but chose in the end to share its spoils. It ends in a highly entertaining draw. Would you summarise what we've seen?